Tina and welcome back to another video here on the channel. I'm Ludwig Nidova. It's been a while since I've made a PV walk, so I decided that it's about time. But I want to do something uh, with it. I just, I don't want to walk around just taking photos. So actually I'm going to use this one and I'm going to go out uh, at night to see if I can get some cool photos using this this filter here my own specialty i've seen people taking pictures of store signs and i think with this filter it will give a very nice look to it let's head out and see if this actually works let's take that off and add this one let's see if i can Let's make my way into into the city. Maybe better better street lights there, so I can get the defect from the lens. This filter gives a really nice flair to to all the signs. It's really quiet out here. Uh, it's a Sunday, so it's not a lot going on. There's a real nice flare to two photos. I will see when when I put them in, in Lightroom later on, if there's actually anything good to salvage from them. Uh, I've been trying to shoot more, more horizontal lately. Uh, before I've been shooting vertical all the time. But uh, I feel like I need, I need to get used to just shooting horizontal so I can use the photos for more than just Instagram. No clue if that actually looked good. It was a nice car. Pretty much never taking a photo of the cranes at night. This is You don't want the photos to be too dark. You don't, you don't want them to be too bright with this filter on. Especially when it's dark and so like this, you don't want the crank die so too high. You want to get a lot of lights in the photo to get that flare effect. But at the same time, you don't want it to be, be too dark around it, because then you get the very, very weird uh, look to it it's like a halo that comes out from the light uh, if it's too dark so if it's too much dark surrounding the, the photo okay, let's get away from the tree a little bit
I'll take a picture of this. <laughs> hmm, I just like the light. sign here in town. Nope. nope. 1036, not a lot of activity. It feels like all, every single light source can be something cool. No clue what I was trying to It all depends. Some photos are too dark. Uh, when it's too dark and a pretty strong light source, it gives out a flare that's not very pleasant. If it's too too bright, uh, it gives gives a look of looks like the photo is not sharp. It's out of focus. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this video. I know I like making it. If it's your first time, consider subscribing so I can see you in the next video. Hold on.